Do it over day! Cow bull blood, yo! Here's the weird out your night with another movie of fright. And <laughs> That's better than a stick in the eye, yeah? <laughs> okay, Groot! <laughs> Woo! Get out! Where's the hole? Groot, tonight's movie. 1944. What the? Get this out of here. Tonight's movie, 1944. Voodoo Man. A Gulardio favorite starring a couple of Gulardio's relatives. We got Bela Gulardio. <laughs> And we got Zuko Gulardio. Yeah, <laughs> Okay, group. That is they say in Ghoul Power Land. Roll the film. Here we go. And now the movie, folks. Yes, miss? Will you please tell me, is this the right road to Twin Falls? That's right. You're a stranger in this part of the country, aren't you? Well, sort of. Now, you keep right on going till you come to a fork in the road. That's about four miles from here. Then turn right. There may be a detour sign between here and there. They've been fixing the road. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. All right, Sam, you can close up. Okay, thank you, sir. Hello, yes, listen. A young girl just left here, alone, about a minute ago. I'll be right over.
we fighting? We won't hurt you. Sent for me, SK? Oh, uh, yes, uh, yes. Uh, this news item about the missing girls ought to work out. An interesting story. Kind of a horror picture, you know. But SK, I'm supposed to get two weeks off. I'm going to get married. Oh, that's right. I forgot all about it. I'm sorry. Skip it. I'll get one of the other boys to tackle it. Well, if you're in no hurry, I could knock it out when I got back. Oh, we'll see. In the meanwhile, uh, give it some thought. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> That's a fine thing to be doing on my honeymoon, thinking of horror stories. <laughs> Good evening. Nice weather we're having for this time of year. Give me six gallons, please. Six gallons? Yes. Gee, that's two coupons, sides of money. That's okay, put it in. Just you say, don't want to run out of gas. Ain't another gas station this side of Twin Falls. Oh, is that so? Yep. Gee, your windshield's sort of dirty. Shall I check your water and oil? Oh, well, I guess better anyhow. <laughs> Okay, I guess. Mm -hmm. How much do I owe you? Oh, I'm checking your tires. Never mind that, here. How, how about your battery? It's okay. Listen, I got some classic car polish, only 50 cents a can. I use it myself, I'll show you. No. Okay. Hey, wait a minute. Keep the change. Darn fool, you didn't even give me a chance to put the gas in. <laughs> <laughs> I sure pulled a fast one on me. I'll go. Yes, miss? Can you tell me if I'm on the right road to Twin Falls? Yes. You're a stranger in this part of the country, aren't you? Yes, I haven't been this way in some time. Now you keep right on going till you come to a fork in the road. It's about four miles from here. Then you turn right. There may be a detour sign between here and there. They've been fixing the road. All right, thanks. <laughs> well, Sam. Yes, sir? Go and check the meters, will you? Okay. Doctor? Another young girl just left here, alone. Very suitable. Yes, it'll be right over. Boy, am I glad to see you. What seems to be the trouble? I ran out of gas. I was just trying to make up my mind whether I should hike back five miles and punch a guy in the nose or camp here for the night. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose you'd like to, uh... Show you back five miles? Uh-uh, I'm in a hurry. 
But I will take you to the nearest gas station this direction. Lady, I'll take you up on that. You picked a bad spot to run out of gas. Oh, I didn't pick it. That sap in the service station back there picked it for me. I paid him for six gallons of gas, and all I got was a barbershop monologue. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that place. I stopped there to ask my way. Oh, you a stranger around here? Practically. I haven't been this way in years. Down here on a vacation? Not exactly. I've been drafted. Hmm? For a wedding. Oh. I'm maid of honor. Whose wedding? My cousin, Betty Benton. She's marrying some sap from Hollywood, a scenario writer or something like that from one of the studios. Hey, you must be Stella Saunders. That's right. How did you know? Oh, Betty's mentioned you several times. You know Betty? Mm-hmm. Do you know the sap she's marrying? Oh, yes. I shave him every morning. You shave? Oh. <laughs> Meet the sap, Ralph Dawson. I'm really terribly sorry. I, I honestly didn't mean That's it. That's all right. Skip it. Don't tell me you're out of gas, too. No, I have plenty of gas. Oh, she's not alone. Well, the battery's all right. I'll take a look. Anything? No, not yet. I never was much of a mechanic. Yeah. It's all right to me. Well, I give up. I can't find the trouble. Well, maybe it's a switch. No. I don't know. I know. What? Gremlin. <laughs> Higher, higher. You know those little fellows that play tricks on aviators? <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, we can't stay here all night. No. Oh, there's a house over there. I'll see if they have a telephone. Now sit tight. All right. Now, bring her to me. You're pretty. <coughs> no, don't hurt her, Big Cole. She's a pretty one. <coughs> Careful. Throw me a frickin' bone here. I'm the boss. <laughs>